Hi there, how's it going? My name is Lindsay. Welcome to my channel and welcome to this week's grocery haul. So I did a Walmart or I'm doing a Walmart grocery pickup for this week. Um, I'm in the parking lot now, but every single spot for grocery pickup is full. So I guess I'm just going to wait for a spot to open up before I pull in. While I wait for a spot to open up, I'll go ahead and read you our weekly meal plan. For Monday, which is today, the day I'm filming this, I made chicken tacos in the crock pot. And Tuesday, the day this will upload, we're going to be having some red snapper. Uh, I think I'm going to fry it in like little bite-sized pieces um, because I just know my kids will eat it that way. On Wednesday, I'm going to grill some steaks that we have in our deep freezer. Thursday, I'm going to do salmon, rice, and veggies. On Friday, uh, I want to do breakfast for dinner. I haven't done that in a long time, so I'm going to do that because it's easy. We usually have everything on hand and everybody likes it, so we're going to do that. On Saturday, I have the Every Man for Himself uh, that I got from Jen on Southern Mama Drama, or we may go out. Um, we are trying not to go out as much. We're trying to limit the spending. It's hard to do right now, but you don't have to go out to eat, so we're trying to limit it where we can. But we also get kind of stir crazy halfway through the weekend, so Saturday will either be, you know, just picking and choosing from the kitchen or going out. Um, and Sunday we will have leftovers. So I think a spot just opened up, so I'm going to pull in here, get my groceries, and then take you back home and show you everything we got. Okay, I am back home now. I was in that pickup parking spot for legitimately an hour. They were so busy. I've never seen them that busy. Um, also, there were quite a few substitutions and unavailable items. And my best guess for all of this is that people are getting a head start on their back to school grocery shopping because school starts here in exactly 10 days. I'm gonna start back here where I usually do and this is where I have some breakfast items. I did get a box of shredded wheat cereal. This is my husband's favorite cereal or I mean, it's like a somewhat healthy cereal. So it's what he likes to eat to not feel so bad. Um, for the kids breakfast, I got them a different brand frozen waffles. It's like some German name that I don't know how to pronounce, um, but it was substituted for the great value buttermilk pancakes, which is fine. I'm sure they'll still eat that. Um, this was another substitution. I ordered the Starbucks, just plain black cold brew coffee, but they were all out. So they substituted it with this Stoke cold brew bright and mellow. Now this won't be an issue for me because I put creamer in my coffee no matter what. Um, but I hope Rob still likes this. I don't know if this is like flavored or what, but we're gonna try it out because we got it now. Uh, my creamer was another substitution. I typically get Southern Butter Pecan every single week, but they were all out and they substituted it with Caramel Macchiato, which is fine, better than nothing. I needed another 18 count of eggs and we like the Happy Egg organic ones. An eight ounce bag of triple cheddar cheese. We needed another loaf of bread and we typically get the Nature's Own Honey Wheat, so I picked up that. Um, this was another substitution. I wanted the little mini non-dippers, but they were all out. So instead we got these non-roasted garlic, like the big ones, um, which that actually sounds pretty good. So uh, I'm not upset about that. And for produce, we did get a five ounce container of the spring mix salad. They were all out of the bigger ones. So we just got the small one. I got a bunch of fresh asparagus a three pound bag of white onions, a single red bell pepper. We didn't need any green bell peppers this week because the last time I went to Aldi, I got a three pack of green bell peppers and we still have them and they're still good. So I just got a single red one, a single red onion, and a bag of small avocados for me and Ava because we are the only ones who will eat that. 
um, that's it for the produce. Apparently we were all out of all of our sauces around the same time this week. So I did get another container of ketchup of Sunny's barbecue in the sweet flavor. That's our favorite barbecue sauce. Some Hidden Valley Ranch, some French's yellow mustard. We were all out of this Kinder's butcher's all-purpose seasoning and I've really been liking this for seasoning like our burgers and stuff um, so I wanted to get another thing of that and while I was getting that it was suggesting all these other Kinder's spices and I just couldn't say no. This is the buttery poultry blend so I'm excited to try this on some chicken and then this is the Kinder's red garlic seasoning. I've heard quite a few people rave about this, so I'm excited to try that. And then for these little single use packs, I got chili seasoning, it's wood fire chili. And then I didn't mean to get two of these carnitas pork style or Mexican style crispy pork seasonings. Um, they substituted one that I ordered for two of these. I, I meant to order one, but they gave me two because one was a substitution for another seasoning they had that I just can't remember what it was right now. But I'm sure all of these will be good. We've loved everything from Kinder's so far. And for snacks, I got a package of these Pillsbury soft baked chocolate chip cookies. These are Raymond's favorite. For me, I got another one of these Ben and Jerry's peanut butter half baked little pints. Um, I got one of these the other week or the week before, I can't remember, but it is so good. I really liked it. So I picked up another one of those, plus they were like 50 cents off on the app. So I went ahead and grabbed it. Of course, one of my Sargento balanced breaks, I get these every week. They're a great quick on the go breakfast or snack. We needed some more pretzels. So I just got the great value pretzel sticks. And then for chips this week, the kids have really been liking the nacho cheese Doritos. So I grabbed another bag of those. And then for me and Rob, I got the Flamin' Hot Cool Ranch Doritos. And that is it. That is everything that we got for the week. I'm glad I did grocery pickup because it really keeps me from overspending and getting too much. Last week we went way over budget and this time we were able to keep it under control. And I will put the total on the screen here now. And that is going to do it for this week's grocery haul. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please consider giving it a thumbs up. I do grocery hauls every single Tuesday on my channel. I also do try on hauls on Thursdays, Costco hauls once a month, and vlogs on Sundays. So if you are interested in that type of content, then I hope you decide to stick around and subscribe and to see you in my next one. Bye.